A recent study showed as many as 40% of people who have COVID show no symptoms, yet they can still spread the disease. And that may be contributing to the surge in new cases here in Wisconsin. So making it easy for people to find out right away if they have COVID is the goal of a new partnership with the University of Wisconsin system and, a federal, and the federal government. Ryan Jenkins is live at UWM this morning to tell us how it works, Ryan. Yeah, good morning. The federally sponsored uh, surge testing program can help provide some support in communities like places here in Wisconsin where there have been a spike in coronavirus cases. And these rapid tests can provide the results and let someone know if they've tested positive for COVID-19 in as few as 15 minutes. It's called the Abbott Binax Now test. It's a nasal swab test that will be offered for free for anyone ages five and up. That includes staff and students in the UW system as well as anyone else from the public who wants one. All you have to do is go online and register. The test will be available at any UWM campus and also at other UW campuses statewide. We're going to post the hours for specific locations on our website, tmj4.com, along with details on where to register for one of these tests. This six-week surge testing effort backed by the federal government has a goal of slowing the spread of coronavirus. It's something that UW president and former Wisconsin Governor Tommy Thompson says will help identify people who may be unknowingly carrying the virus. There's a, a surge capacity really to get those super spreaders, those that are asymptomatic, out of the area where they're going to spread this terrible disease and quarantine them. And testing will begin at UW Milwaukee at 9 o'clock this morning. Hours vary across the state at different locations. Again, no walk in appointments, so make sure to go online, check the hours, the locations, and register to receive one of these tests for free. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ryan Jenkins, TMJ4 News. All right, Ryan, five minutes.